All right, guys, where are we going? Where are we going today? We're gonna go to Marshall. Yes. We're gonna go girly shopping. So I wanna bring you along with me just to kind of see what's new. Um, yeah, if I spot some new stuff, I'll vlog it. And let's go ahead and head out. It's a gloomy day. He's so right. It's so right. It's so funny because I normally, okay, if I'm not vlogging, right? <coughs> Excuse me. If I'm not vlogging, I love to turn on the radio. I like to sing out loud, but I'm not going to do that today because it'll be copyrighted and I'll be a little too embarrassed to sing. I wonder, okay, if I'm singing a song, I don't know if y'all know the answer to this. But if I'm singing a song, right? Um, and it's, you know, the same rhythm, same words as a song. If I'm singing it, would I still be copyrighted? Not I, but the video. I don't know. Let me know in the comments down below because I'm not too sure on the answer to that. So maybe one of you guys would know. so we're here let's go see what's new how did you like my dancing hopefully you enjoyed it anyways <laughs> let's go see what's new and then i'll do a little mini haul i guess after just to show you what things i did pick up let's go Thank you. 
my gosh, it's so windy out there. I got some cute stuff, so I'm gonna show you what I got at home. So I'm gonna be going out of town, not too far from where I live, but we're gonna do like a pack with me, but I found a lot of cute stuff, so I cannot wait to show you when we get home. Okay guys, so we are back. Look what I got. Isn't that so pretty? Here. I love it. I love the design. Okay, so this one was $24.99. I love how it has the straps. Adjustable. And then I have more stuff in here that I bought. So I ended up picking this up. So this is a hair iron case. I'm gonna be doing a pack with me, so I bought some stuff for that. So this is for the hot tools. What else, what else? This one I picked up for um, my chargers and everything. And then, let's see, how much was this one? $6.99, this one was $5.99, which was such a steal. Look how pretty the pattern is. And then I picked this up so this one is a travel laundry bag. This was $6.99. And then this one, I figured it would be for travel too. So I can put my beauty sponges in here and they'll be, be protected, you know? So this one was, oh yeah, she scanned the other one. So this one was $4.99. This one did not have a tag on it. But isn't that cute? It's a artesian blender set five. Anyways, it has like different sizes in there. And then I picked this up. So this one is the Morphe 2 Cheek and Lip Mousse Wonder Tint. This one's in the shade Dream. So that one, that one was $3.99. And then look at this. I got the matching. Well, it's not actual matching, but um, for travel, whenever we go out of town. So I picked up this tumbler. This one is a large one. It's a 24 ounce and you get a straw with it. It's so pretty, it's plastic. This one was $12.99, and this one, this one was $2.99, and I've been looking for a brush like this one to put for the bottom lash line, like some shadow. But, okay. It is the next day, and I had good sleep last night. Okay, so we are gonna pack together. So I got some stuff last night throughout like my beauty room, my bathroom, and um, we are going to pack. Ooh, ooh. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Okay. So um, I went ahead and put like a no makeup makeup look and I just change into comfy, change of clothes, just wanna be comfy. I want y'all to pack with me. First, let me open up this. I just got this in the mail. Look how pretty the, the, the bottle is. It's a glass bottle in case y'all were wondering, it's not plastic. Yeah, see? And I got another color too. Ooh, this is the love one, the pink. Look how pretty, right? Love that. And then I got two more in here. So the two are this one, Pink Pineapple Sunrise. Yeah, let me move this out of the way. Pink Pineapple Sunrise and uh, Sweet Petal Pound Cake. Let me smell. Ooh, so, so good. And then this one. Oh my gosh. You can smell the pineapple in this one. So pretty. I love Bath & Body Works packaging. It's so girly. Well, like most of them. It depends what you pick, you know? Hold on. Let me set it up so y'all can see how pretty it looks. You know what? I need to turn on. Hold on. Look how cute that one is. I don't know if y'all saw my uh, my vanity tour, but this one I got at Marshall's for $5.99. Have some jewelry in there. Okay, so let's go ahead and pack. Um, so I put all my stuff in here. So yeah, everything in here 
that I got last night, we're gonna put into here. I know that this is like a cooler, like a travel cooler case, but I'm gonna use it as like a, we're only going for three nights, okay? For three nights out of town, so it's not gonna be, uh, I'm sorry, two nights, three days. And so it's not gonna be too long of a trip, but I did pack up some toiletries and everything. So this is the perfect size, I don't know. I just feel that it's a perfect size for what little trip we're gonna do. I need to turn on some more light. Okay, so I just got a variety of of clear bags. I find that clear bags are the way to go. You can see everything and you don't have to be like second guessing where you put what, you know? So I like to use clear bags for that. This one I just recently purchased also um, for $7.99 at TJ Maxx. Uh, this one was purchased at TJ Maxx as well. It came with a small one. I don't know where the small one is. It may be in my purse or my other purse, yeah. But anyways, uh, this one is a Ray Dunn. I think the set was like $7.99 for the, the duo. Um, what else? This one I got on Amazon. And it's pretty cool because you hold your brushes in here and they're upright. And it's protected by, you know, it's like a waterproof. It looks like mesh, but the outside is mesh and the inside has some plastic in it. So this one I, I will link down below. These are really inexpensive too. Very good for travel. This one I just brought in case. I like to use this for makeup brushes too. It's real easy to go like that and then just reach in there. But anyways, I may not use that. I don't know. I also have this one. Just kind of random. I don't know. I may not use it, but I just wanted to bring a lot of bags so we can pack together. So let me get a drink. Drink my coffee. Okay. So first off, let me go ahead and take off all the tags. goodness this is really on there wow I'm gonna have to use some goo gone for that one right there okay <clears throat> so the, the other bags I do have here let's move that one out of the way the other bags I do have here is this I do have the matching uh purse like purse backpack that I am using currently so this matches that really well and then, of course, we have this one. So, where to start? Where to start? Okay, we're going to start putting stuff in here. Maybe my clothes should go in here, right? No, no, no. Okay, I'll put my toiletries. Excuse me. Yeah, I'll put my toiletries in this one. And then I'll put my clothes in this one. Like, I'll roll them up, you know? We'll put it in there. Okay, first I want to put my hot tool in there. This one I got on Amazon. You guys, this is so nice. It's great for travel. And you can, of course, uh, curl and straighten your hair with this. And it's rechargeable. Look. Look how pretty it is. I love the little heart on the on and off switch. But yeah, it's so portable, easy to travel with, and then... It just clicks on and it does come with a charger too, but it's already fully charged and ready to go. So I'm just going to use this. Um, I'll wash my hair tonight so I won't have to take like a blow dryer or nothing like that when I go. Remember, it's a small, short stay trip. So all I need is this. Okay, so this one is self-explanatory. I'm just going to put that in there just like that. Okay, um... This is the uh, the case that I'm going to be using for the chargers and everything. So this one's to my iPhone and then my husband's will go on the other side 
for his Samsung. These you can always find at Marshall's, TJ Maxx, Walmart, you know, Target, it, everywhere they sell stuff like this. But I find that the cutest ones are at Marshall's and TJ Maxx. Okay, so let's here. I need to move these out of the way here. We'll put these in here for now and take them out as we go. There's a lot. There's a lot. We'll do the makeup last. I'm going to keep the makeup in this bag. And that's last. Okay. Hold on. Hold your horses. Okay. This is going to go with that. We're going to start with these two right here. Okay. So skincare. I cannot go a day without putting skincare on, okay? I think it is so important. So what I'm gonna do, and I always have to use face masks, whether it's like a clay mask, a sheet mask, a peel mask, um, but I prefer peel and sheet masks over like the ones you have to rinse off and all that, but, but I'll use those also like once a week at least, so. Okay, so with that being said, I may switch out. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna take out the makeup from this one and use this one for the skincare because it's more boxy. So we're gonna put the face masks. So a few of them, my favorite brand is the Frutia. And this is another Frutia. This one I found at Marshall's. And then this one was so good. If y'all see this one, this one's by the brand Curette. If y'all see this one, this is so nice. And I've tried plenty of sheet masks. So we're gonna put those in here at the bottom. There, okay. And then I have a couple of little repurposed little containers that I like to use. I love to repurpose stuff. So the first one is this one. Where did I get this? Amazon? In here, I just have Q-tips and my floss sticks. This is gonna go in here. And then I also have my cotton squares. So this one, I think I purchased at Target in the travel section. It did have Q-tips in this one, but I kept the little box and I am using it for my, my cotton squares. See? I put all my cotton squares in there. They just hold them so nice and neatly. And then this one is a Trident gum. I don't know if you can see the Trident little logo right there. I just took off the sticker and then I used it. I'm gonna take these. I always have to have tweezers. The Elf tweezers is a good one too. Um, tweezers, a little scissors, and just something to clean my nails if something goes wrong <laughs> something goes in my nails so oh yeah and a nail file just in case you never know so that's all that I'll take for for the tools you know so that I'm gonna put there here let's no we'll do it like that I'm gonna try to fit everything as best as possible okay so there it goes so far so good <laughs> okay then um, I do have the Kleenex little travel things. You can get these anywhere. There's your Kleenex. This I'll probably end up putting in my purse, but for right now, I'm gonna go ahead and put it in here. Like that, off to the side. Then I have, these came in a pack of four during the holidays, so I'm finally getting around to using it. They expire 2024, so you gotta just make sure you use them in a timely manner but anyway so these are just makeup wipes and it's a small pack great for travel and i'll put these right here then i have this one pick this one up at tj maxx and you know i forget the brand it's a mini facial cleanser exfoliator and it already has so many uses in it and yeah i've only used it a couple times so this last like 
a long time depending on how often you're going to use this travel thing you know so anyways i'm going to put this in there these lather up the facial cleansers so so well if you've never used one of these okay, so that i'm going to put there i love how it has its own little case you know and then the other thing I'm going to put in here is this. So this one's by the brand Melody Susie. This is like a face, a facial stimulator, has the hot and cold. It, it really, it really works. Anyways, so I'll link this one down below as well. I love it for travel too. Look how cool it is, right? Rechargeable, everything. Let's go ahead and put this simple eye makeup remover because I like to double cleanse. So I usually like to take off my makeup initially with this and then go in with a towelette and then go wash my face at the sink. So I'm gonna put this in there. So there it is, there is this bag. We could still possibly fit more stuff if we need to, so we can go back to this. So now we're gonna go into this bag. For this one, we're gonna put more skincare. We're gonna put my soft finish sun milk. This has SPF of 50 by Misha. I got this on Amazon. I love how thin it is. This totally reminds me, and to me it's a dupe for the Shiseido face SPF, you know? And then, so anyways, we'll put that there. And then this other one I love too. This is the e.l.f. Daily Hydration Moisturizer. I love that one. It uh makes my skin feel soft cleansers so there's a couple of see i have two of these small cleansers so i'm going to take both of these to use them up so i recommend that too if you're going to go for a couple days a week travel why don't you use your travel sized ones that you normally put off to the side and don't use and take them out for when you do travel that way you can use them up you know so i'm putting these uh elf facial cleansers i really love the elf skincare line and then for toners i'm gonna put these small again small ones of the pixie the rose tonic and the retinol tonic i love to tone before my skincare so i'm gonna use this for the daytime and then the retinol one for nighttime now i need to include an eye cream so for the eye cream i'm going to put in this first aid beauty one this is so nice i love how it's great for on the go i love the squeezy tube on this i have my chapstick the cotton candy i also have this one the lip volumizer this is so nice this one i got on timu's website by the way if you haven't watched the haul i will link my timu haul down below and then I also have this one. So this is the Prime Essence. So this is kind of getting into makeup prep, you know, like skin prep. So I'm going to include this in this bag. Yeah. This one I'm going to include for my nighttime lip moisturizer. I'd love to have something thicker on my lips so it can really saturate throughout the night. So this one's the Frutia one. I got this on Amazon. And then I picked up this one at TJ Maxx. So this is the Kapari Lip Glossy for the daytime. And then two more, actually three more small products I'm gonna include in that. I do have this Drunk Elephant Proteiny Polypeptide Cream. I have this Peter Thomas Roth Cucumber Gel Mask at night. And then I also have this bouncy mask from first aid beauty so these ones you have to leave on for five to ten minutes and then rinse them off with a lukewarm water and a towel washcloth you know so i have that just in case i want to pamper myself and the bottles are small so like why not you know that is it for the skincare this is just all for the face i still got to get my shampoo and stuff Okay, anyways, I want to include these two in here because we do have more room. So I have this Victoria's Secret Love Rollerball and then this Soap and Glory Missed You Madly Fragrance Spritz. I don't need to take a whole perfume, you know, just something to smell good and yeah. Anyways, so we'll put that there. Yeah, so look how I packed up a lot of stuff and it doesn't even waste a lot of room. So I'm gonna put these like that and I'll put one on one side, one on the other. 
Okay, so now we're moving on to the uh, face brushes and makeup. The majority of the actual face brushes I have SL Miss Glam. And these are from her brush book collections. I will link her, her business page down below. She's another YouTuber. I have almost all her brush books. So I am going to put these in here along with my eye makeup brushes. That's going to be it for those. So nice and neat and compact, you know? Okay, so we're going to use this one instead. So I have this Impressions Vanity one. And we're just going to put this Blink one. I got this in BoxyCharm one time when I did get the BoxyCharm, but I got tired of it. I don't know. Anyways, this has a variety of colors in it, blush shades and highlighter shades. So there's a variety there. I love how it has a mirror too, just in case. So there's that. And then I have this e.l.f. bronzing one. I'm going to use this for contour and bronzer. This one is in Bronzed Beauty. And then this is, let me see, hold on, hold on. I'm going to do all the palettes first. So I do have this Runway Ready Pink Kiss palette. I picked this up at TJ Maxx for $3.99. So inexpensive. It does come with a, a lip brush too. So I love that. The colors are so creamy. They wipe off easily though, just so you know. Okay, so, so for foundation, I have this Revlon Color Stay. This one's in the shade... 180. I got my setting spray. This is from BU. The palette I chose to take is this, the Creme Shop. You can still get this at your local drugstore, wherever they sell the Creme Shop. Um, I just saw them like three days ago. So this is the Mickey Mouse collab around the world palette. The reason I picked this one is because it has a dark shadow, like almost black, where I can use it as a liner, you know? which I love to use eyeshadows as liners. So we'll put that there. And then this is just for a pop of color. These are great ones to use the Physician's Formula for pops of colors, I'm telling you, watch. I don't know if you could tell, but it's just beautiful for pops of colors. It, you may not be able to tell, but I'm just gonna put that right here. Let me move that over and put it right there got a few more products brow products uh eyeliner i do have this l'oreal brow set stuff i have this laura mercier pencil so pretty look at that this one's in the shade in case you want to know metallic taupe so i'm going to put those in here as well i have this strobe cream from mac that's the pink one the two mascaras I'm gonna take are the Lash Princess Waterproof and then my, my Better Than Sex Mascara, non-waterproof. And for lippies, I'm gonna take this 26 Nude, the Milani line, and then also from Milani, I'm gonna take this 130 uh, Situation Ship in the Keep It Full Max Plumping Lip Lacquer Gloss. <laughs> and then I'm gonna take this Color Switch since it's going to be a few days and then this I have to take with me for my little peach fuzz flyaways. I have a lot right there. <laughs> put that like that. And then this is just going to be in its little separate bag. You know, let me put this. This is from the Kenzie line. I got this at Marshall's for really inexpensive. I think it was for like $8.99. And it has a little stand too. Isn't that cute for travel? Yeah, see how it turns on. Although the lighting isn't the best, but it does turn on. Just like that. And that's how it's done. <laughs> We're going to put that in the center. I may need to take that out. Hold on. And then the brush thing. Can... Like that. There we go. And then this, of course, will go just here at the top somewhere. I'll be right back. For my body wash, I'm going to take this Soap and Glory Clean On Me uh, shower gel. And it has built-in body lotion in it. Isn't that cool? So this you could pick up at the drugstore. And then I have to take my trusty secret deodorant. So 
And I don't have a small one, so I have to take my large one. We'll put this one at the bottom, and then we'll put this one right there. Okay, so far. Okay, so now we're gonna put the hair products in. Like that. So for the laundry, I'll put like that, and then the cords like that. That is it. I think that's it. So of course, anything else, I'll just put at the top because I do have room. Yeah, so that's the pack with me for the makeup and the toiletries. I'm telling you, you guys, use your imagination. This is like a cooler, but I'm using it for just a travel bag, you know? Use your imagination. And then, oh my gosh, I got this on top of it to take it. Put my Milo's sweet tea in here when we travel. Oh my gosh, that's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be an amazing feeling. <laughs> Then I'll put my clothes in this one. So yeah, just like that. And then I have my purse. See, look, here it is. So I'm gonna have all my little matching travel totes and then my drink and then this. How adorable, right? I need to do a what's in my bag because currently I'm using this one right now. Okay, so you guys, I'm gonna end it here. I think that that's gonna be it. I hope that you enjoyed it. Uh, let me know what you think of the video. I hope that my vlogging meets your expectations. If there's anything that I can improve on, comment down below just your thoughts. I'd love to, to get your feedback and your thoughts on what things I can do to improve my channel or my vlogging style. I don't know. Uh, but I'm, I just go with the flow. This is my personality. I'm always uppity. Well, the majority of the time. I'm always uppity. I like to dance, sing. Uh, act silly. I love to go shopping. Um, if you are new here and you like this video or you like my company, don't forget to press the subscribe button down below. Push the bell notification so you'll be notified for any future videos just like this one. Don't forget to like and I'll see you on the next one. Bye guys.